like to think, and the sooner the better, of a cybernetic meadow where mammals and computers live together in mutually programming harmony like pure water touching clear sky. I like to think, right now please, of a cybernetic forest filled with pines and electronics where deer stole peacefully past computers as if they were flowers with spinning blossoms. I like to think, it has to be of a cybernetic ecology where we are free of our labors and join back to nature, returned to our mammal brothers and sisters and all watched over by machines of loving grace. Welcome to the Clark County Historical Museum. I'm Susan Tussaud, the Executive Director of the Clark County Historical Society and Museum. Of course, tonight is extra special. We were very fortunate to have an opening of our autumn trout gathering, and I'd like to recognize the co-curators for that. Um, Dr. John Barber is up here. If you'd stand, and then Jeanette Altman, where are you? You need to come in here. Actually, it's really more of a triple header, I guess, because we do have the Brodigan Library here now at the museum, and John's going to talk more about that, so I'm not going to go into great lengths. Um, but I would like to point out that um, Ianthe Brodigan is here tonight, uh, Richard Brodigan's daughter, and also Todd Lockwood, who is the original founder of the Brodigan Library uh, in Vermont. 